Hey, this is Jamie from Caps Computers, and I want to welcome you to our walkthrough video of Ro Devolver Digital's Ronin. This one is the first level. It's actually a bit of a tutorial here, so I'm going to be doing a lot more talking than I normally will do for most of these videos as I show you how to properly, or at least how I did it, to get through the entire level while completing all three objectives so you can get that ever so important skill point here. Some general tips uh, while we are going through this tutorial level. Each second in this game is considered one turn. It's not really very clear in the tutorial, but if you ever notice those numbers on the top of the guy's head, that is one turn, and it's also one second when the game is no longer running in turn-based mode. Uh, the other thing is, if you noticed a couple seconds ago that when I was doing one of my jump arcs, the arc turned red partially after a certain distance. Now what this means is, this is how much ground you can cover in one jump, and then right where the red starts is where your game's gonna, I guess, pause. Now I did this back, so I have some skills I don't normally would, well, you would probably not have in this level, so I am doing this ev with everything that comes, all the skills that you could probably get at this time. So as you can see here, I'm trying to quickly get up there and kill the guys as fast as possible without the alarm triggering. Now it's not... For me, when I first started, I didn't really get what when the alarm actually triggered. And what it is, is that lockdown is the actual alarm. So you're more than welcome to just like run in and kill as many people as possible without having to worry that you're going to lose the alarm objective. So there you have it, this is the first level. It's a tutorial level, it's very simple, it's very quick. Honestly, most people are probably going to actually need this walkthrough for this video, but hey, for the sake of being a complete walkthrough, here you go. Catch you on our next tutorial!